friends. Good morning. Good morning. So very good morning to all. Today we are going to see about a case study on additive manufacturing. Before going into the topic, we must know about the meaning of additive manufacturing. What is additive manufacturing? Fabric is manufacturing, Nakas is manufacturing, so these 
are the competitors. So when you bring the component to the market, there may be some competitor. So here in this case, what is the difficulty is to test this component it may take some time. After testing and after uh, you bring it to the market, there may be some competitor. So the lead time is more. So what happens is uh, the, uh, the So this company uh, approach with this uh, problem to that range of ready shop. So uh, ready shop is a 3D printing manufacturing company where they they use to provide solutions for the companies to use the technology. So this is the background of the case. So you can see here room precision manufacturing uh, has been supplied at class 1, 2, 3 medical devices to the automatic market for over 35 years. Right? Because these devices will ultimately end up in impacting people's life. It is essential that rigorous quality procedures are applied to help to achieve safety and effectiveness. So this is what very much important. Achieve safety and effectiveness of the device both during the and following implantation. So this is what the device which you are able to see here. This is the automatic implant. So this automatic implant, uh, the chance here is increase the manufacturers are increasingly incorporating novel complex structure. Novel complex structure means, for example, your face will have a different geometry. My face will have a different geometry. So case to case the geometry varies. So you are able to you are able to manufacture means imagine uh, a person is uh, having an injury on his head, right? So he has to be uh, replaced with some uh, bone to be replaced with some other implant within a period of time means manufacture in design, manufacture, test and then uh, you implement it will take some 3 months of time. Those 3 months of time the patient will be like huh? loss of life, am I right? Because uh, the, the time and going to, uh, to operate or to recover is uh, very much important. So that is why we use uh, the 3D printing in this case. That is what the solution here. So 3D printing uh, generated a uh, uh, quantum build up uh, preparation. So this is what the software right so they are improving implant performance and longevity so you can see here this company cpm carries out a series of offline tests such as chemical mechanical morphological properties of the implant right the tests are essential to measure mechanical and chemical consistency of the implants so they can be a time consuming that is what i am trying to mean here the time consuming process and it adds overall cost per pound so for example uh, imagine the rolls royce car what is the application of the rolls royce car it is a handmade thing have you seen the rolls royce interiors why it is so costly because everything is a handmade thing and it is a uh, it, it consumes more time so while you case to case if you build the profile so what will happen is you will consume time as you consume time the manpower it will increase the cost directly it will reflect the cost of the product so that is why we use the 3d printing machine here so here this is that machine we use it for testing. So you can see the component which is placed on the chuck here, right? And this is the inspecting machine. This inspecting machine implant, tests the implant and the geometry of the implant. And it is it is an automated test. So this, uh, this reduces the time period for the testing. So this is what the solution provided by the company Renisha. So Renisha's AM technology produced complex structures in one manufacturing operation. As an example, it began, it began accessing the use of gyroid lattices. This is what the gyroid lattices on acetal cups. A design feature which would not be been economically feasible to produce before the investment in AM. So before AM, they are conventionally testing and they are conventionally they are, uh, performing the operation uh, manufacturing. So here they used the AM based manufacturing process. So this process has reduced it uh, and it resulted uh, good, uh, good rigorous quality testing and it, it, it resulted a very good uh, density as well as good ions models there. The strength of the component also increased. So this is what the result. So Redisha is a strategic partner in driving the advances in AM technology. So we come to conclusion that in this case you see here this mainly visualized that the component which is manufactured conventionally through time, whereas the Renisha, the service provider who uh, provided a solution through additive manufacturing. So through this additive manufacturing, uh, the time is reduced as well as the precise and ends uh, models also increase, the density of the component also increase, which means a good quality product is produced. So this is how uh, this is how the uh, solution is provided for this case. So I hope you have listened uh, and you have understood the application of additive manufacturing in the field of medical.
Alright, so is there any clarifications? We can ask some clarifications. 